New tonight, a man is taking Universal to court. He has one arm and was not allowed on a ride. Fox 35's Connor Hansen joins us live tonight. Connor, he claims this was discrimination, but you found out that that may not be the case here. Well, Dylan Campbell says he went all the way to the top of one of these rides before somebody told him he had to turn back because you need to have two hands to get on it. That was about three years ago when he was here celebrating his son's birthday. Now he's still involved in a legal dispute over who can and cannot ride. Now Campbell, who was born without one of his arms, says he's never let his disability stop him in the past. Here he is lifting weights. He played basketball in high school and still plays weekly. The ride in question, the Krakatau Aqua Coaster, is a raft with handles that goes down a water slide. Earlier this year, a federal judge ruled in favor of Universal, saying the company is following the law by following the guidelines created by the manufacturer. Campbell and his attorney now appealing that ruling. His attorney believes the Americans with Disabilities Act should override Florida law. There's a lot of emotions. You know, obviously, I was born like this. And so I've made, you know, I made it my, my life's goal to make sure I can do everything. And um, so this was kind of, you know, taken away from everything that I've worked towards. And there's a, there's a pride aspect as well. Now, we reached out to both Universal and the ride's manufacturer, ProSlide. Universal never got back to us. ProSlide saying it didn't want to comment because there's still a pending lawsuit. Reporting live in Orlando, Connor Hansen, Fox 35 News.